road, we will find the trailhead. We're gonna go down Owl Canyon and back up fish. Two more nights back in the uh, backcountry here. It's gonna be awesome. We've got less water, some more beer, some good food. Yeah. <laughs> we are here at the Fish and Owl Canyon Trailhead and we are starting our second half of our trip going in today's Tuesday March 13th going to camp out near the confluence of Fish and Owl Canyon we're heading down Owl Canyon and then we'll spend another day down there getting near the exit of Fish Canyon and coming out of there on Thursday. Spent three days and uh, two nights out in the desert doing the Grand Gulch and here we are for the second route. It's gonna be fun. You ready for this? Let's do it. Gonna get the pack on and get this get this trail started. Writing our name down. And we're heading right 0.25 miles down to Owl Creek. Fish Creek will be a mile and a half. We'll be doing that on the way out. Ready, baby. Yeah. Job bless. We are leaving the register at Fish and Owl Canyon. We're ready to go here. It's about 10 cars in the lot, despite there only being two other groups that backpacked in from here today. Awesome conditions to start a hike. It's probably low 60s, patchy clouds, a lot of sun. We are descending down into Owl Canyon. Already climbing on some big stuff. We gotta go all the way down there, whew, around the corner. Small ruin down there, if you look. It's got, it's hard to see under the shadow, but. Treacherous, bro. Look at this drop in. Let's get hit hit. Descent, bro. We are descending Owl Canyon. Steep, slick rock descent. Climbing these layers, going through rock falls, all sorts of stuff. We're gonna camp at the confluence, or nearby, to Fish Canyon. Tomorrow we have all day to get up fish, camp, and then we come out Thursday. Just building, building Karen's, Karn's, <laughs> to forward others' adventure. Kerns. People getting lost out here with the Kerns and the Karn's and the Karen's. It's a knee beater. Man, that was quite the Smash descent. Smash down that. Whew. Warming up. Guessing almost in the 70s. They said maybe 64 or 66, 7 ish, but it's really hot. Pop, lock, and drop. Pop. Slippery waterfalls down to that pool. It says Owl Canyon 2018, March 13th. It says on the map there are three sets of falls. This is the first one. I think we're going to go straight ahead through that to the right over there. Then there's another set and then a third and then there's an arch. So we're trying to get a few more miles here. It's 440. Deep pond, at least what? Eight feet, six feet? 
Nice. I don't know. I think I saw a submarine. We have made it to what I think is falls number two. Heading down into Owl Canyon. This pool is huge. So a lot of water. Thinking this is Falls 3 or the start. There might be another piece around this corner, but going up and around this corner and then finding a place to camp. We have made it to the arch that we've been aiming for today as far as distance. It is up there. It's pretty cool. You can see the wall behind it. Now we're looking for a place to camp, to be honest. It'd be pretty cool around here. We have Neville's Arch up there. And I... We saw this trail across the way. We are over there. Sure enough, it's an awesome campsite. Awesome campsite. Tent area. It's even got this cool seating area. So a great spot. Excellent. Excellent. Me beer thirty in a minute. Dude, we got lucky for this spot. Yeah, we did. Maybe, I think I actually even get, yeah, I think I actually even get on top of it and sit like at the base of it. Good shit. Colors are just blowing up on it right now. It's about 6.45, sunset, supposedly 7.30. We're setting up camp at this great campsite overlooking this arch. It is morning of our second day here in Fishing Owl Canyon. Here's Neville's Arch, our campsite down there, and the sunrise. We had a pretty great spot for this first night. Got uh, some Sprouts Organic Instant Coffee. This is the dark blend, but I added some sugar, powdered milk. Ooh wee. Ooh wee. About to make some oatmeal, but this coffee's pretty good. Saying goodbye to our camp in Owl Canyon. Sun's coming through. It is about 8.50. 8.50, that's a later start than we hoped. We're enjoying the Yeah, enjoying this. We are heading out. Day two, we got about seven or eight miles. We want to get close to where we're coming out tomorrow. That way we'll have a short day in the morning. Saying goodbye to the arch. Last look going up Owl Canyon. Neville's Arch. We're heading east, southeast to the confluence and then back up Fish Canyon. Making our way down Owl Canyon.
Jamie does some uh, cool photography. Uh, what, what, check him out at, what, what's your Instagram again? Never Stop Exploring. How, how do you spell that? NVR, Stop Exploring. Check it out. Check some it. Cool pictures of stuff we do. Different moments that capture here and there. It's all right, I guess. No, you can say whatever you want. Say something. Yeah. I wanted to show you what we are doing here for our route. I was going to show it last night and I forgot to. We drove down this road to the trailhead here yesterday afternoon. And uh, this is Fish and this is Owl Canyon. They meet right here. Um, we went down Owl Canyon yesterday and camped right here at Neville's Arch. And now we have walked down and we are to the confluence down here um, where Fish Canyon starts. And we're going to camp up about here today. And then tomorrow, hike out to the car and leave. Really cool grass circles right here. They're all pretty circular. It's really cool looking. They're like little gardens. Heading up uh, Fish Canyon. How do we feel about that? Heading up. Let's go fishing. Going fishing. Let's do some fish. Fish Canyon. Maybe we'll make some clam chowder. Oh, clam chowder. We're, We're heading in. Style, of course. No, yeah. <laughs> we were told there's a beaver dam right here. Looks like that's about right. A little trickle. Good amount of water in here compared to Owl Canyon. We are making our way forward through Fish Canyon now. This walking up along here has been very different as far as terrain goes. It's ranged from walking along slick stuff like this to sandy washes. Peanut butter, jelly. Second day in here. Fish Canyon. Going up, a little bit of water. And looking for a campsite. Quick moment of shade from the sun, this big cloud right next to this point right here is pretty cool. It is 3.30 and we're about, I guess about a mile and a half or a mile from climbing out of here, which we'll do tomorrow morning. Now he's seeing the trail. This man, legend. <laughs> do you see it really? Yeah. All right, so here's looking at the, our camp tonight. The uh, soil circles pictures we got. Oh yeah, Lilo. those are awesome. Clones, it's been a pleasure. It's easy. <laughs> Leaving camp from our fourth night overall, second night in Fishinel. Got to climb up that wall right there across the way and out, however long that takes. And then once on top, it's a mile and a half on a good trail over the mesa to the parking lot. We are looking over the pool above where we camped last night and at the base of where we're heading out.
took the route and you were joking about coming down there. I came around this piece of rock. Went up on the edge. Last look into Fish Canyon and then our campsite. Yeah, a little bouldering in the morning. <laughs> Heading out and away from Fish Canyon. So we have a mile and a half left on a dirt trail on the Cedar Mesa. Yeah, buddy. All right. We exited. Yeah, dog. We made it back. It is 9.50. We wanted to be here by 10. So what was your favorite part about this Fish and Owl Canyon trip, Ooh, Jamie? Fish and Owl Canyon. The night, well, our first night in the canyon at the Arch. That was epic. The hike to it coming down Owl Canyon, past Three Falls, gnarly descent. And then to get to that Arch was just such a nice treat. I think that, I think that would do it for me. What are you thinking? What was your favorite? I would say that day too, coming into that camp, finding that great campsite. Um, we were looking at the arch and looking across the way on the north side of the canyon towards some brush and would have been a little more exposed but still had some sunlight. Close up of these bad boys. Yeah. Looks like uh, he got blasted with a sand gun. Some love and some desert love. This is going to be it. We did two canyons, the Grand Gulch adventure with uh, Dominic, Jake, and Sam, Jamie and I. And then afterwards we did two nights in Fish and Owl Canyon. It was awesome. And now it's kind of snowing, so.